Hello everyone, welcome to Geeks for Geeks. Today, in the DFA NFA complete guide, we will be discussing about a problem or to construct a DFA, which where our DFA will check for strings, which will start and end with same symbol. Okay, so let's deep dig into it. So our uh, discussion point is, is construct a DFA for set of all strings starting and ending with same symbols. Okay, so given the alphabet, suppose our alphabet is A B. Okay, so same symbol means we will accept the strings A A, B B, okay, or A B A, or maybe B A B, okay, maybe A A A, so kind of that. And adding to it, it will also it should also accept the null string because that is starting and ending with same symbol. That is actually no symbol, and it should accept a single length string, okay, where the starting and ending conditions will uh, by default will satisfy, okay. So, what kind of problems it will be? So, the initial state should be the final state because it is accepting null. And if if it is getting a single symbol A, it should accept. And if it is a uh, if, if it is starting with A, then it should get B as an ending symbol. Okay. I mean, if if it is starting with A, okay, then the ending symbol should also be A. Okay. If it is getting a B, then it should go to some of the non-accepting state. And from the non-accepting state, if it is getting another A, it will come to the accepting state. Okay, it will come to the final state. And here having multiple B's will be in will be in, into the self loop. Okay. And here if we get multiple A's, the string will be accepted. Fine. So because it is starting with A, so the ending symbol, the end symbol should be a only okay if we are getting anywhere b if we are getting anywhere b we will we'll go to some of the non accepting states and from the non accepting states we need an a to come back to the final state okay so this is going for all the strings that is starting with a okay all the strings that is starting with a so what about the strings that is starting with b so we need to take an another path for all the strings which are starting with b so same thing will happen just the symbol will be different okay so for all the strings starting with b we can have multiple b's but whenever we are having uh, a we'll go to some of the non accepting state okay whenever we are having an a we'll go to some non accepting state here multiple a's can come but from there if we if we can get another b okay if we can get another b so that means that our string is ending with the same symbol right it has been started with B, it is ending with B. It will come back to the final state. Right? So, this is our corresponding DFA. Okay? So, this is our DFA corresponding to the given problem. I hope it's clear. Okay? If not, you can just rewind the video. And after that, if you have any queries or question, you can just put it into the comment section. So, thank you for joining and stay tuned to the playlist for getting another such important and interesting problem. Okay?